Welcome to Pallet Jack and Blogs. What is up beautiful people? TJ here with another episode. Today we're going to be looking at a few retail spaces. Uh, actually just one in particular I'm going to show you. Um, so we are looking to kind of expand. Uh, I'm not sure exactly how or where we want to go, but we want to get out of this space because we've um, kind of outgrew it. So as you can see in the last few videos, I've been trying to like kind of move things around in the store to make it a little bit more accessible, make it more um, where you can get to things where we can organize stuff. But in terms of like our unpacking the pallets and uh, getting pallets in, it's a very large, it's a hard process because we gotta get the pallets in, we gotta take them to my house, put them in my garage to store them, and then we can bring the stuff over here. I have to put it in my truck, bring it over here. Uh, luckily, I only live like five minutes away, so it's not necessarily like a big deal, but um, we're definitely looking for uh, growth and expansion, and um, we're trying to see what that looks like. So our lease here um, ends in like six months, so we got about half a year to kind of figure out where we want to go. Um, but in the meantime, if we find a space that we like, um, that we agree on that's going to be business effective uh, for us then we may go ahead and sign a lease at the other place and kind of slowly move over to that place so once we end our lease here uh, we can move out now we were planning on expanding to you see that little door well it used to be a door right there um, we actually were planning on getting that space and there's two other spaces behind it that we we're going to kind of expand into um, but it was always going to be an issue with um, you know the space because we we couldn't unload pallets in there. We don't have a double door or a bay door or anything uh, to unload pallets. So our next space, we need to have some way uh, to get the pallets inside of the building where we don't have to break the pallets down, um, you know, like that. So uh, the one space that I found, it's pretty cheap. It's pretty cheesy looking. I don't really like the aesthetic of it. Um, you know, I like stuff to kind of look nice. So uh, eh, I don't know, we're just gonna keep looking. Um, I think God is going to put us in a place to where we'll have a bigger and better space and then maybe we'll have like multiple offices, one for me, one for April, uh, something like that. So let's look at the space. Uh, we actually sold one of these lamps on uh, Amazon for I believe $67. So I'm going to get that packaged up and what else did we sell? We sold this. Um, this was on the smaller lights box that y'all just saw, uh, and it sold for $129.99. So that was actually a pretty good sale. So I'm gonna pull that. Actually, hold on, let me let me get this. All right, what else did we sell? Back to the office. <laughs> uh, this, which I've already packaged, was something. This is the uh, that chi. Um, you see it on the screen. It's that chi set, that chi curler irons. We sold that on Macari um, accidentally for. $24, but we don't, <laughs> I had to pay $9.99 shipping. And that was the um, the gaming, 3K gaming monitor. Uh, and we actually sold that on eBay for $1.19, I believe. So those are already packaged up and I'm gonna package up the bottom ones. And I'm gonna get out of here. I've got so much stuff to do today. Uh, we've still got all of this crap to list. And it's not going to get listed today. Um, we've still got some baby stuff over there to list. That video is probably going to be coming out next if it's not out already. Um, and then I got a price gun. I've got to I'm gonna set it up today and see uh, how it works. April, what do you think about getting a new spot? We need one. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you just. I mean, this place is all right. Yeah, it's okay. But uh, those are all us. Stuff we just packaged up right there. Yeah, but That's if money. you look in our office, it's out of control. Yeah, so I've been tripping. Look at this. 
and our kitchen. We're not gonna talk about it. Uh uh, I'm gonna show y'all. This full transparency. This is what you get when you start liquidating. Out here looks good though. Yeah, look, <laughs> look at this little space. We got stuff everywhere. It is. Look at all these boxes. We need a dedicated shipping area. And this is supposed to be our break room. Yeah, this is the break room. Allegedly. You ain't got no break room <laughs> when you liquidating. Look at that. We ain't got enough space. There's stuff everywhere. Oh so we will go out and go look at some spots. the office place space it's heat it's cold and heated in here kind of yeah. <laughs> look at every face y'all <laughs> uh so it's heated and cooled here and then you can close this door but the customers will have to come in through that door right. through here okay so this will be our only like office space or ring up place so, I mean, this will have to always be clean. yeah this will always, so have, to always, clean. always have to be clean yeah and then so the, this is a little bigger. yeah this is the warehouse area that's it, yeah. so that's where you thought the uh april thought that was storage units yeah, watch that okay. um so it's a bay door here and it's a bay door there so i'm this is just my vision you could bring in pallets over here so we could have like i don't know six or eight pallets over here in this area and then we could process the pallets and bring the stuff in over here so we would have shelving you know, shelving here and shelving there. And it's got a little bathroom. The only thing, they ain't heated or cool back here. No, so uh, it looked like what they had there was a, um, like a uh, one of those little air conditioners that you hook up, like the one I got in my basement down there. Um, it ain't perfect. <laughs> but it's got potential, I think, and it's cheap, $600. Yeah, it's so it's a thousand square feet, a thousand eighty eight square feet. And what we're in right now is what eight fifty. So it's a little bit we'll have to do something about because it's hot. Yeah. It's hot in here and it ain't got no now I think if you shut that bay door right there and then you had the air on, it probably will cool it down enough to where it wasn't like miserable in here. Yeah. Um, but it's definitely like a warehouse. Yeah. <laughs> So what do y'all think? Put the, down in the comment section below what y'all think of this um, this space, this potential space, compared to what we got right now. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, it's uh, I mean, I could see it being judged up a little bit. We can we could juice up this little area right here. We can maybe just do two desks like we got right now. We just do a desk in the corner right there, mm -hmm. and then we will have maybe the register over here. Um, we wouldn't have a packing area. I mean, we have to make a packing area out there. Yeah. Yeah, and then uh, we would have to do our videos. They have to be back there too in so the warehouse area. Yeah, because so the thing about that is everything will be in the store. Everything will be, yes. So, yeah, crap everywhere. So, now, I guess we could section it off some kind of way to where, I don't know. Like, you can make like this area packaging. Like, we could put uh, like a curtain up right there or something where that's just for packaging. Nobody can see it. But it would cut down on our area right. out here. And we need all the space. We need all the space we can get. Yeah. <laughs> the only other thing will be to package it back here. Right. So just uh, you talking about just put put a wall up right there? Yeah, like block this off like even from where we get pallets and stuff in. So. Right. Yeah. And then just have this area with, with the stuff. So I mean we could put it's enough area in this space to put like one, two, three, four, five, six seven probably seven to eight of those big black shells that we got yeah so that'd be plenty enough space to put the the uh the stuff but it ain't pretty no we have to get creative yeah and then also we was talking about the parking that yeah. was yeah yeah let's look at the parking now. yeah the other part is the uh the parking and parking ain't great Yeah, the the, okay. the like in terms of where we live, right? So it's kind of in the center of the city, so it will be a good area, right? The only thing I'm concerned about with is people being able to find it because of yeah, how because far of, it's not like sitting on right on the side of the street, or right? You gotta yeah, you gotta come back around the corner and 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 yeah. over and down. And like, oh, it's Sweet Five Twenty Three. It's all the way in the back. Turn around the corner <laughs> and come down that hill. 
Yeah. They already struggle. We're coming. trying to find where we at now. When well, you say directly <laughs> across the street from the sheriff's office, and you see them driving up and down the street. <laughs> so. All right. Well, let's go to the next spot. Yeah. This is about equivalent to the same size that we already got. Right. Yeah, the front part of it is probably what we equivalent to what we got right now, and then the back of it. But it would be easier to have a place to store all the, ex the excess. Right. Yeah. The excess pallets. Yeah, we can put the pallets and stuff in the back warehouse part. And it's got a uh, a loading dock in the back. Uh, it's got bay doors in, and it's got a loading dock. So it'll be a little bit better for getting pallets. All right, let's go to the next spot. All right, so this is the third and final place that we looked at. So this place is uh, a little more of, of a like office area. But as you can see right there in the front, it's got double doors. Um, so we can get pallets through there in the front. Uh, I'm going to insert some pictures while I'm talking uh, of what the space looks like because you can't see through the window. But, uh, yeah, it's pretty big. It's got uh, three offices. It's got a kitchen area, and it's also got a bathroom. Uh, so I think that it'll be uh, really good for us um, to kind of move in. Another thing, it's got plenty of parking. It's got parking all over here, and uh, it'll be easier because the main road is right there. That's the road that goes, like, to the mall area. So it's got a lot of space. Um but we just need to uh, to see what we're going to do. I'm actually go over here to the window and see if you can see just a little bit of it. I don't know if you can. I don't know if you can or not. Let's see. So that room would actually be uh, like the front area. Like when you first came in, uh, we would have like the registers and stuff up here in the front. It's just the front doors. And then this room would actually be where we would put the pallets in. So as you can see, it's kind of got a double, it's got a double door and we would put pallets in this room. We would store them here so it wouldn't be in the main area. And then in the back, it's just got a really, really large room. Uh, so we would actually uh, be able to put like shelves and different things like that. All right, that is going to be it for today, guys. I really appreciate you guys for watching. Uh, if you like these types of videos, please like, share, and subscribe. I really appreciate it. Also, hit that bell icon so you can get notifications whenever we release new videos. I will see you guys on the next one. Peace.